people my people the wounded civilian guy salute you all you are my people you know because i know together we'll fight this fight and the victory will be ours i just came back you know from work a lot of people my friends family people have been calling me telling me our governor Edo state governor mr godwin Nogera Obaseki is in Italy. You know, he is the governor. He have the right to come to Italy. I believe he is in Italy because of this uh, human trafficking thing. And uh, I also saw it on the news today that uh, those state governor have built a formidable structure and system to receive and integrate the victims of uh, human trafficking and illegal immigration who are indigenous of the state. He said he have built the structure, you know, that these people, our brother that is dying, suffering in Libya, can come home. Our brothers in Italy who have no document that is roaming about, people that is roaming about suffering in Europe, should come home. Because we have fine structure, uh, infrastructure, we have provide job. There is job for them to do at home. But that is a lie. I am not against Governor Baseki. It is my responsibility to support him and fight this fight, this human trafficking fight. To make sure that uh, we, we really fight and, and stop it. So that our 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 young girls and boys will stop, you know, taking this risk of crossing the Mediterranean Sea, dying on the Mediterranean Sea. When the government said that, or the governor said that he have he built uh, infrastructure, uh, he have, he, there is job for these people to do at home. He is lying. That is where I have problem with with the governor. He is lying. This thing, this human trafficking thing in Edo State, it's not, it's not something of a joke. It's not something we take for a joke. The government need to be serious about it. The government need to be sure, need to be, need to, need to know that this thing is a serious matter. It's not something you play, you play politics with. Don't politicize it. Don't play politics with it because people are dying. A lot of youth are dying trying to cross to Europe. You don't play politics with it, saying that you know you the inf you, you you have already built infrastructure. Uh, there is job for them to do, as if all is well in Edo State. You know that that is a lie. The government this fighting this human trafficking thing is not what the governor can can fight alone. All hands must be on deck. The people of Edo State, our parents, the even the upper of Bini, upper Ay the second must be involved. This is not something you sneak out and sneak in. Governor sneak, sneak out, go to Italy, make some noise, take picture with some rich people, go to Germany, take picture with some rich people, go to uh, Spain, take picture with some rich people. That is not how you solve this uh, human trafficking. People are dying. This is a serious matter. You don't play politics with it. The, gov the governor has to come out, have to prove to us that he is serious. I have nothing against the governor. But trying to play politics with it, that is where you have problem with us. You are trying to play politics with it. You know that there is nothing at home. And don't come here and try to, you know, to be telling the Italian government to deport people that is already here, who have already taken the risk, crescent Mediterranean Sea, to deport them home. No. What we are going to do now, how to stop our children, how to stop our young girls, our young boys, not to come again, because there is no job in Europe. People are sleeping train stations. Youth, Nigerian youth, they are homeless here, no job to do. Without, you don't have a, 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 a European document. How can you work? People are suffering here. So the problem is not telling Italian government or telling Spanish government, France government, German government to be deporting Nigerians who don't have documents here. It is how to stop our children that is still planning to come. The government have to come out serious. Have to involve our parents. You have to educate our parents at home. The other have to be involved. You know, guys calling me that Obaseki is here. Obaseki can come, he's the governor. 
when we when we criticize government doesn't mean that we hate them that we should condemn every step they are taking no it's to see that to make sure they are serious is to tell them no go this way go that way this is how we are going to solve it you have to really involve our parents at home the upper have to be involved otherwise you can't human trafficking this can these things boys girls are coming to europe to do it's not part of our culture and it can never be part of our culture. These things have been going on for over 30 years. It's time for us to put stop to it. Europe is not is no longer the way it used to be. Things are hard now. Things are very hard in Europe now. It is time we tell our parents, educate our parents, not to encourage their children again. Our bicycle is not serious. That is what I know. I am not here to criticize Obaseki that, you know, guys calling me, telling me Obaseki is here, you know, insulting him. No, look, I know Obaseki is a fake governor, but he's just one year in office. He's still after three years. He can still change. He can, he's, our, it's our mission to always, you know, criticize uh, the wrong step. Not every step. Him coming here is not the problem, but coming here to do what? Of what benefit of him coming here? Or to language our money, the infrastructure is said he have laid down at home. Is it the uh, Allah without some that they invite all these uh, 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 musicians to be jumping, singing, singing, uh, dancing, uh, skilly woo? Is that the infrastructure he's talking about? That is a lie. Obasi should be to, to tell himself the truth. Should be serious that this matter, this human trafficking matter, is a serious business. It's not something he play politics with. People are dying. Trying to cross Mediterranean Sea. They just buried 26 girls. 26 girls. And our stupid government is aware of it. And then they started, uh, they, 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 uh, they, uh, and they, uh, they tried to petition Italian government because he buried these uh, 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 girls who drowned, who, who, who died on the Mediterranean Sea. When the world were talking about it, that 26 young girls from Nigeria died on the Mediterranean Sea, our government kept quiet. Kept quiet. So, my people, I just want to make this short video. Thank you.